This is showing the dad bod way too much, bro. No way, dude. Look at your pecs. Do you work out? These aren't pecs. They look These like These are it. moobs. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on guys? I am Matthias and welcome to a brand new video and today I wanted to let you know that while Tanner is joining me Yeah, I am. I don't consent to it <laughs> <laughs> Actually, that's not what I wanted to let you know I actually wanted to let you know that this video is sponsored by Flexi Spot. If you don't know what Flexi Spot is Well, it's a brand that makes a unique and interesting product which happens to be our first item whoa that's crazy so before we get into that i'm gonna let you know whether all these 10 items in this video are lit or quit you know what i'm saying if you got new year's resolutions are they gonna help you stay lit during them yeah. or are they gonna make it so you quit them boobs <laughs> <laughs> That's Jay Fred's joke. I can't take credit for that. So let's get into this product. So FlexiSpot, the makers of the all-in-one desk bike, desk size pro, sponsored this video. As you can see right here, it's a desk where you can get work done, but also exercise. That's my dream. That is your dream to get work done and exercise? At the same time. Exactly. To be like so focused maybe in maybe like say you're gaming, let's say you're riding. What else do you do? <laughs> Let's say you're doodling and you want to get a little bit of a, a leg workout in the process. You know, you want to get those thick thighs. This Ooh. is the way to do it. Ooh, 2018 CES Innovation Awards. That's pretty nifty. I actually did not know that. Let's take a look at some of these pictures. Oh, so you can go forward and back with the desk. Uh -huh. And what's this? Resistance. Track your exercise more scientific. Make exercise more efficient. That's dope. Oh yeah, see, she's doing her homework on it. Wait, no, not her. <laughs> not, not her. Yeah. She's a little old for homework. <laughs> she's doing her homework homework on it. This is a girl that wants to get so much work done. She's not exercising while she works. She's working while she, she exercises. exercises. That's right. That's cool. So it looks like it's for all ages, all shapes and sizes. If you're pear shape, yes. If you're a stick shape, yes. If you're an inverted pear shape, yes. That means you got a really big head, <laughs> but a skinnier body. Add to cart. Here we have the Desk Sizer Pro. Got this little manual. That's great, no, you know we don't read those. Nope. If I lift this up a bit, you can see right here, it can do, can you hand me that manual? <laughs> I'm gonna need to read that. <laughs> we read it sometimes, all right? Only sometimes, when we really wanna know about the product. Yeah, not because we need it. So it can track the time you exercise, the speed when you exercise, the distance, calorie, and the RPM, the literally the speed of the wheel internal. Adjustable seat. Ooh, that's actually really easy. So like you can it. have it multiple sizes. So this one goes down and or up, so that's cool. Because you wanna have those good ergonomics, you know? Yeah. You gotta have the right angle. While it's very ergonomic, you can set it to exactly your preferences. So much movement. Yeah, I can respect that. Get those legs pumping. And then we just kind of like exercise our problems away. That's negative one resistance. I was like, I'm so fast. <laughs> Let's do it on eight plus. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's gonna do it. <laughs> that's gonna get dead fit. <laughs> Trying to write a memo to the office, and I'm just like <laughs> getting really irritable because this hill is so tough, but yeah. knowing in the, in the, yeah. You know you're about to sneak out a fart. I can't do I'm gonna be honest with you. Sneak out a fart? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, down. so that's a little bit too intense for me. That's for much stronger people, but it's nice to know that it's good for all of those people. But for us weak people, less resistance the better. If I put it on absolutely zero resistance, I can pretend like I'm working out. Look at how hard I'm working out, Amanda. I'm gonna get fit for you in no time. Sneaking donuts. She doesn't know. I mean, I'm gonna guess I'm like a four. I'm out of shape. I'm actually hoping this is gonna get me in shape. I'm gonna go put this in my actual office that I do real work in, not this work. No, this is not bad. I thought it was gonna be way more difficult to do. I've used some of these kinds of products before. They kind of like move your upper body a lot. They tend to make you a little bit less coordinated. But that makes more this, sense. since you can rest your arms right here, like my hands feel like 100% coordination. I could just type away. Oh, but that's tiring. What did I do this for like five seconds? Don't show a man of this video. <laughs> I'm gonna rate this product a lit. You don't know what to do? I'm gonna set a New Year's resolution to use this product frequently. I'm gonna start right now. Frequently, that's what your goal no, is. No, I'm literally gonna start frequently. <laughs> I'm gonna that's a that measurable up. goal. Yeah. How about this, Tanner? I will use it so frequently, I will use it to review the next product that we have. That's a good start, but we'll see. It's next so product. Sure. Box Legend Clothes T-shirt folder. Oh, it's a T-shirt folder. I thought it was like some type of special Lego creator. Create special Lego. <laughs> No, no, keep moving, stop! Your Sorry. laughing is distracting my movement! It's 
working. You're like the unhealthy, the fat mat is so much more fun. <laughs> I like the beers and burgers mat, <laughs> not this stuff, all right? <laughs> Are you mad of messy clothes? Wouldn't it be from? Are you mad from messy clothes? It still doesn't really make that much sense. I can't believe messy clothes exist in this world. All right, cool. This is dope. I'm gonna shut this and give me the product. Let's see how good dad is at folding clothes. Oh, look, it comes with instructions. You know what we do with instructions? Throw it on the ground. Yeah, but first we read them. So I assume you've prepared shirts for me. Yeah. If I'm not mistaken, I put this up like this, and then I fold this like that. And I do this, and then I do this, I do this. And that is a perfectly folded shirt. Okay, why would you start me off on the long sleeve, bro? It's short really sleeve's just... much easier. All right, here, I'll give you a try with short sleeve. Short sleeve is easier. <laughs> it's great hearing how out of breath you are right now. <laughs> short sleeve, boom. Boom. No, no, I did that wrong. Yeah, boom. Okay, there's, there's it is. Let me grade it. No, don't. <laughs> Top is good. Back is wrinkles. Well, I can't control the wrinkles. The wrinkles already exist. So yeah, I mean, this works. So I'm gonna say this one's lit. All right, dad's getting a little hot and he doesn't want to be sweaty for the rest of the video. I am getting a workout. Next product, large 2018 bubble wrap poster sized wall calendar. Why though? You just pop it. Mm -hmm. So you, when you're done with the day, you're just like, here's the satisfaction I get at the end of every day. I think you'd do it at the beginning, wouldn't you? you do it at the beginning? So then what do you look forward to at the end of the day? Sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody's happy about the beginning of their day. <laughs> what? At the end of their day. Why are you making fun of me for my statement? I was like, yeah, whatever. I'm a little depressed, whatever. Don't talk about it. This is 2018, so that's good. Add a card. Oh, what? That's not how I thought it was going to be packaged. When someone buys bubble wrap, what do they pack that in? <laughs> Questions of the right universe. Now. Wait, what is this? It came with like this little thing here. I'm so curious. Oh, okay. Look, they're tacks to pop those bubbles in case you have like bubble popping ineptitudes. Oh, or tack ineptitudes. That hurt, How's dude. your hand? Is it bleeding? No. You didn't even check. <laughs> <laughs> I want to see blood. Really odd the way this is laid out. Super long. That's what she said. Can we just talk about the, the front here? We have all these extra ones that have already been popped. Oh no, this one hasn't. They gave us an extra day. This one is like June day zero. You know what I'm saying, dude? Wait, something's happening on June zero. What? I don't know, something scary probably. Invisible people. Invisible people are happening on June zero. Everybody run! Oh, <gasps> that's loud. That's good, dude. Here's my only problem with this. Yeah. The bubbles are on the opposite side. Have you noticed that? They put the flat surface on top. Nobody likes popping the flat surfaces. That's accurate. You see, I'm pulling this back and I'm popping it. Yeah. So this. Do How do we even pop that? You can't. Mm -hmm. But nobody wants to use the tack. Well, here's the issue with using a tack. No satisfaction, right? Because guess what? If you use a tack to pop a bubble, that's it. That's the sound. That's the most dissatisfying experience a man can have. Maybe I'm, even women. I'm <laughs> <laughs> so how do you pop this? There we go. You have to do fast. <laughs> Kill <a> mouse. <laughs> yeah, but let's look too about like the day. Say you're in January. Someone can come over here in the middle of January and you're like so excited for the rest of your year. You can't wait to pop the rest of the bubbles. But then someone comes in here on like January 10th and pops all of December. You can't even tell. I mean, if you were like, even like a, a day in the middle, like you can't tell. How are you gonna know if someone just pops your entire month until you get to the month and you're like, oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm gonna say this one is a quit. Sports research sweet sweat jar. Thermographic study after just 20 minutes of exercise. <laughs> That's what you are after. That's what you are after, after you get some sweet sweat. Okay. <laughs> Why should this creepily nod yes when you switched to the Because <laughs> <laughs> I was already nodding. No, I was, okay. I was thrown back because I got a question. Who exercises in the middle of a parking lot? She's one of those types of girls that's like always with the selfie and like every picture on her Instagram is just her stomach that she took. Mm -hmm. And she's like, wow, so blessed. Works out 10 hours at the gym. Oh my gosh, blessed. Just had Thanksgiving dinner, rip. <laughs> <laughs> no, but then it's always like the same picture, just like in a different bathroom. <laughs> This is the next level of that, okay? You don't have enough followers on Instagram, so you go out into the public and show people your ripped ads. You know, you go out in public and you're like, all right, not enough people at the gym. Maybe if I go to like a Trader Joe's parking lot, there's tons of people there. I'll just work out in the middle of the parking lot. People are honking. <laughs> Get out of the way, ripped ads. I don't blame her, you know? If she wants the attention, I'm sure someone's gonna give it to her. Yeah. Live demonstration. What's going on? 
on guys, we're here at the LA Fit Expo 2007. I'm assuming he has to ha not have a shirt on for this demonstration. Because if the rest of this video doesn't allude to the fact of why he's shirtless, I'm gonna be upset. Because <laughs> I just watched the shirtless man for no reason. <laughs> he's just shirtless talking. <laughs> Today we're gonna show you a live demonstration of how Sweet Sweat works. You wanna apply a Good. nice thick layer I'm glad. I mean, I just said I was glad that another man was rubbing stuff on his body. <laughs> yeah, I'm not glad, I'm just, I'm happy that there's a point to his shirtlessness. Continue. Also, you wanna make sure you don't rub it in. You just kinda wanna rub it off. Don't rub it in. Rub, rub it, it on. on. You ever been like rubbing lotion on and your wife walks up and she's like, no, you don't rub it in, you rub it on. I'm just like, oh crap, I did it again. I applied lotion incorrectly. I just applied my suit sweat, now it's go time. Okay, so he's jump roping. So now what is he doing? What endurance he has. So his body's heating up on the sweet sweats part. So it's essentially forcing him to sweat. What's most likely happening is he's clogging up his pores or he's like really like insulating his skin and that's pushing him to sweat. I believe you can achieve the same result by just wearing clothes, but maybe I'm wrong. <laughs> no, shirtless is the way to go. No, shirtless, no. See, it's the same thing. This is for Instagram models. They wanna get the sweat, but they wanna show off the pecs. Nice. Thanks. Good job. I, I didn't uh, take a second to write that. Uh, let's add the card. Sweet sweat, workout enhancer. Apply an ample amount, topical gel. I'm not about to work out. I'm not gonna doubt that the product works. I mean, I don't necessarily understand like the difference between just like wearing a plastic bag. It'll have the same approach. <laughs> I'll probably look better in a plastic bag than rubbing this on my body. Well, <laughs> Let's be real. You look good in a plastic <laughs> you bag. You look good. I've seen it. Especially when it's over your head. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm, I'm just curious how it smells, okay? Oh my gosh, it is so potent. Your nose isn't as good as mine. No, my nose isn't as good. It smells like a Yankee candle. Wow, it does smell like a Yankee candle. You're so good at this, what the heck? I've smelled many things in my day. <laughs> it's not a bad smell. I say no, first ingredient is petroleum. I wouldn't rub that on my body. Use coconut oil. It's just synthesized, as far as I know. Petroleum is not a natural ingredient. So I'm gonna say it's quit. Men hot. <laughs> Let's leave it there. Neoprene workout sauna tank top zipper waist trainer. Literally the exact thing that we were talking about in the last product, this is the alternative for it. This will get you to sweat. Well, it kind of does still allow you to show off your masculine or feminine muscles. Yeah, that guy looks jacked, let's be honest. I, I ain't scared of him. You. Michael is right. He's not even wearing it. That's why they're cutting off his face, dude. This is a Photoshop. What? I feel violated. No, that's not right. I feel betrayed. <laughs> Add to cart. Now I feel violated. <laughs> I hope you got, oh, I hope you got like an extra, extra large for this dad bod. Yeah, dude. I know how big you are. Oh, sweet. We have a custom note written in Comic Sans. In order to provide more high quality products and best service to our customers. We hope you can give us a positive review. <laughs> the, the email address, taillong at cena.com. <laughs> taillong. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't, dude. We're just trashing their email. <laughs> hey, what, what do you want to name your company? I don't know, something suggestive. Tail long. Yeah, you know what a tail human long. tail is. <laughs> we have some brevity in this breathability. And you zip up the front. I'm gonna okay. put this on. Do you think I am like, oh, oh, okay. It's tight. You look like Han Solo. I'm gonna throw that out there right now. And now you look like the guy from Guardians of the Galaxy. Oh my gosh, that is tight, dude. You look yoked. You look so strong. <laughs> Are you seeing this, everybody? This is showing the dad bod way too much, bro. No way, dude. Look at your pecs. Do you work out? These aren't pecs. They look These like These are it. moves. <laughs> <laughs> Got those love handles going. I mean, love muscles. <laughs> Whoa. What if you put that under your shirt? You probably look so buff. Maybe. Do I feel like doing it? No. Nah. <laughs> you are stepping the table like it's a bar. You come here often? <laughs> Do I look at a place? <laughs> Mm. Oh, this is definitely squeezing my gut. You never want to compress your guts. Smart water bottle with reminder to drink water. Is that what makes the water bottle smart? Or is it smart and it also does that? Yeah. <laughs> this water bottle is very intelligent. Also, it will remind you to drink water. But that is just beside the fact that it's very intelligent. <laughs> I was like, does this say it's very intelligent? I was like, oh, oh, it what does. Do you what is, where? Oh, it does, intelligent cup. Oh my I haven't God. even gotten there yet. Come on, quit reading the description before I do, Tanner. Apparently you were reading that. <laughs> I know. So it's intelligent also with a timer. Buying this item, I'm expecting that it has other features and other intelligence Says. That's ironic, saying the word intelligent wrong. I'm a smart boy. I think the only thing it really does is just keep time and remind you. Here's the big question. Actually, let's forget that big question because I've just stumbled upon a gold mine. Okay, look at this woman. Which one? Yeah, you're right, all of them. None of them 
are using it. They're all using mugs and cups and- You're right! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I don't know about you, but at 7 a.m., like this lady, I am not in that mood. I'm like, everyone's evil. I'm going to destroy the world. <laughs> until I get my coffee. This woman's like, Drink a bottle of healthy, pure nature mineral water instead of tea or coffee or other beverage. Water can complement the loss of moisture in the air conditioning room and make you more fresh. I've always wanted to be more fresh. Now this is a story all about how- Wait, they just did a whole entire like paragraph on why you shouldn't be drinking tea or coffee and the way he's drinking tea. Yeah, literally- Did they know what they were doing with this? Literally at 22 o'clock is drinking <laughs> coffee and tea. Drink a little water before going to bed. Enjoy your sweet night. <laughs> Dude, maybe I do need this product. I want a sweet night. You know what I'm saying? We know who's buying this product. <laughs> Add the cart. Not bad packaging. Eight time. This just looks too small for me. Like, I don't want to have to refill it a thousand times every day. You know what I'm saying? There's the reset feature. What? You look down there, like the bottom is right here. <laughs> look. Wow. What does this hold, like eight ounces? Let's add some batteries <laughs> to this. Oh, relax. Oh, okay, so you can, it can alert you like every hour. I mean, a little bit clunky to set up. Like, why not just have something that says like, would you like it every hour or would you like it every other hour? Or would you like it off? Yeah. And then just have something to set the time. I mean, I guess someone could have like the individual nature of like, well, at 7 a.m. I'm still doing this one thing that I can't drink my water, but at 7.05, I can. You know, so like maybe that's it. But other than that, I feel like it's like, a whole lot of work for something your phone can do 10 times easier. And this, it's like eight ounces in here. I'm gonna say, quit. Stay positive in a jar. Tips, quotes, and questions to spark upbeat thoughts and attitudes. I already feel upbeat, don't you, Tanner? <laughs> the way you just changed right now, I feel jazz. <laughs> positivity in a jar. So you open up the jar and you get some positivity. Is it like in the form of pixie dust? Is it in the form of notes? Is it in the form of cocaine? Is it in the form of, I mean, what are we talking here, you know? It's just a jar of $100 bills, you know? <laughs> that I would be down with. $9.99, that'd be a good deal. Also, what is a book supplement? Take doses of this book regularly. <laughs> Add to cart. Stay positive. Boost positive thoughts and attitudes in kids, quotation, and adults. Tanner, I will take one and you take one. Okay, and we have to tell each other. Yes. What are some things you can do to keep yourself motivated when you feel like giving up? <laughs> You're gonna tap into my life that heavy already, man? <laughs> Answer it, dude. Um, I start talking to myself, and that sounds bad, right? But when I start talking to myself, I automatically make myself like active. Okay, so that's kooky talk, clearly. Give me yours. Think of a friend or family member who has a positive attitude. How do you feel when you are around this person? How can someone's positive attitude help other people feel good? Okay, too? so the person I first thought of was Mike, Mike Badal. Oh, good call. Um, he's always a positive person. How do I feel when I'm around him? Yeah. Sometimes like strangling him. Oh, sick. <laughs> <laughs> because I'm like, why are you so happy all the time? Be upset once in a while. <laughs> all right, let's take these around the office, see if we can inspire some peeps. Just pull one. <laughs> He's like, uh, that's a long one. <laughs> I can't read. Did you know that physical activity leads you to a happier you, which boosts your immune system, and that being active outdoors gives you an extra boost of trying to get outside and get moving every day? <laughs> That's the most, that's the best <laughs> advice ever to give to an editor. Yeah. Hey, listen, uh, I feel like you should keep that, put it right in there, just remember, get outside once in a while. Oh look, another editor. Pick it random. Pick, oh gosh. Reward yourself for taking care of boring but important tasks. What's that? You cleaned out your backpack? Read a comic book! <laughs> Make these rewards a habit and you'll want to get the job done. <laughs> Perfect! <laughs> Did this thing literally just say that you weren't reading enough comic books? <laughs> <laughs> I mean... Stay out of school and read comic uh, books, kids! Hey, <laughs> if I'm gonna give you advice, I'd say, hey, stop with the comic books. Get outside once in a while. <laughs> That's not what the card said. I gotta listen to the card. <laughs> Pick randomly. It's good. This is a positive thing for you. Also, why is your shirt stained? Why is it stained? It's just right here, bro. Don't <laughs> <laughs> I knew that was coming. <laughs> Turn off your phone, tablet, or computer for an afternoon and spend time doing something you enjoy. He's kind of doing that right now. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Doing a little mix session with Mike. But it's on the computer, so. Yeah. I mean, it's not a tablet, so I'll count it. Just hand over your tablet and phone to me right now and I'll confiscate it. <laughs> <laughs> Advanced stop snoring solution, anti-snoring and sleep aid device. Is that a binky? I feel like, is that a binky? <laughs>
<laughs> it's a pacifier. Yeah. It's a pacifier for adults, dude. <laughs> that looks weird, dude. It looks like he's sucking on some like fruit in like a clear plastic bag. Yeah. <laughs> what the heck is that, dude? This, I can tell you for sure, is a way to emasculate men. <laughs> it prevents your tongue from slipping back into the throat. Oh, I have that problem so much. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> Aren't you ever just like talking and then I'll go, oh, oh, dang it, my tongue oh my slipped God. in the back of my throat again. Yo, that's his tongue. <laughs> you stick your tongue through <laughs> No way! <laughs> you stick your tongue out. That's not real. That cannot be real. What is So you're supposed to go to sleep with your tongue out? Can you imagine <laughs> sleeping like that? All right, good night, honey. <laughs> Wouldn't your tongue just dry up or something? <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Promote a full night's rest with your partner. They're implying that someone that would put that in has a partner. <laughs> yeah. All right, man, this is it. Deep sleep pro. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I just want instructions that tell you how to use it. That's all I'm- that's all I want. We do not suggest sleeping overnight with the device for the first few nights. What? <laughs> Run the Deep Sleep Pro anti snore tongue sleeve under warm. Literally that's all it says. Run it under warm to soften the silicone. Oh my gosh. I can't Warm stand what? <laughs> <laughs> do people not read their stuff? I don't understand. Before inserting, make sure the V notch, okay the V right here, mm -hmm. is facing downward. Gently push the tongue into the bulb until it is touching both sides. Lightly squeeze the bulb to create a gentle suction. Oh my god, dude, this is teaching you something else right now. <laughs> Stop. Oh my gosh. How's that feel? Alright, now you're man. Come on. You would never be able to go to sleep with that. It pinches your tongue! Oh my gosh. <laughs> Are you killing it? This is like the Kylie Jenner challenge for the tongue. I'm gonna try and say this is the kind of- Oh! This is the Kylie Jenner challenge for your tongue. <laughs> <laughs> you ever wanted one of those big plump tongues? <laughs> you ever wanted to impress your friends with a fat tongue? A thick tongue? Two C's? <laughs> Look at this tongue I got. If from the deep suction pro. Burn it. That is not lit. It's a quick. Lecal, lechal, lechal. Smart navigation and fitness tracking insoles and buckles. Oh. You put it in your shoe or on your shoe and it helps you track stuff. Navigate hands-free without looking at your phone. Even when offline. Get detailed route guidance through simple vibrations and patterns. You get navigational assistance from your shoe. One buzz right, two buzz wrong. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> How do they calculate reroute? It's just like freaks out in your foot. Your foot. Oh, my foot's freaking out. It's making me go the opposite direction. I know this is the right way. I have the cart. The world's first haptic footwear. Interact with your foot. Stay fit. Navigate. I mean, your feet are the things that are navigating you. Your feet are the things that move you from place to place. So wouldn't it only make sense if your feet did the thinking of where you were going to go next? So your brain could just be like, forget about it. I can focus on other things, like finding a woman <laughs> or fidget spinning. <laughs> Both of those go together. <laughs> nice packaging. Yeah, not bad packaging. Got even better. Yeah. If I make a product, I'm gonna knock this off. Hey, Whoa, knock it off. That's actually really Really clean packaging. Look at that, dude. What in the world? Does it's it like, come with one sole? This right here is the sole, and then I assume you put the thing in there. Please tell me there's another sole. Yes, thank okay. you. Because <laughs> I was like, this is gonna feel really awkward if you only have one. So I assume this right here is, oh my word, look at this, dude. Packaging on point. Like, I was making fun, but these things are made with precision and finesse. Searching for peripherals. Ah, okay. So this is a charge pod. Oh, you see these, this metal, this like metal beveled edge? That's actually the connectors. You can see in there, it actually connects to it. So I put that in there and I plug this in, I'm assuming to activate them. No pods found. That's a bummer, dude. They don't include instructions on how to actually first get them connected. I mean, there's no buttons on this. Taking a break, looking at all of the YouTube videos on how to start it up, none of the videos tell you how to start it up. And other reviews of this product said a very similar thing. How do you even get it to work in the first place? I mean, I'm sure there's this thing that it's just going right over our heads, mm -hmm. but this is a, a, a critical failure. Maybe I'm thinking maybe you give it like there's got to be movement things in there. Does that wake it up? No. Maybe I put it in the pod to do it. I felt them vibrate and now there's a flashing light. Pod's found. There you go. Connect. Register. What? We just did this. <laughs> I'm so frustrated. I literally can't
can't get this product to work. That is a quit. Quit. <laughs> you were just so easy. You're like, yeah, yeah, let's quit. I was <laughs> waiting. To, I'm like, if the interface is this bad, the app is this bad, the product is this hard to get going. And like, I think that's the biggest travesty in these modern day like companies is that they make these hardware products and they just don't fully think through the application and it just destroys what could be a potentially great product. Mm -hmm. We'll never know. Padlock wristband, smart wearable that breaks bad habits. Behavioral technology, mild electric stimulus. Ooh, so you're you're familiar with Pavlov? Pavlov dogs, yeah. Okay, well you were, I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Explain it to me. So Pavlov dogs is a experiment based off of conditioning, right? Pavlov. Okay, explain it to me like I'm eight. Every time he shocked them, his dogs is Pavlov. Into believing that they get that. Oh my Did God. Did you fall asleep? I fell asleep. Don't quit your day job. <laughs> <laughs> Add the cart. Have lock. Cool packaging. I feel like we've seen some good packaging today. Yeah. I'm impressed. So this thing, every time you do a bad thing, it will shock you. So here's what is dumb about this product. And here's why this product fails out the gate. Who's gonna go and shock themselves? It doesn't work. Mm. You can't, like, yeah. you can potentially condition yourself. But wouldn't it be just as effective to just not do it in the first place? To just have discipline? To just have discipline, life. yes, exactly. <laughs> what happens when you eat sugar and you're like, I don't feel like punishing myself? That or it's kind of masochistic if you think about it. Yeah, like. I know, that's what I'm saying. So this isn't gonna help a person that wants to quit a bad habit that they don't hate. You know what I mean? Honestly, I'll probably just give them a new habit of just wanting to shock themselves. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but what if you gave someone else the control? No, but then you could just be like, no, ha, no. Oh, but I mean, maybe on an app because you can mm -hmm. control it from an app, but then you have to have someone buy you 24 seven. All right, here you go, dude. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm gonna try and train Tanner. Tell me if this works. It was a vibration. It's We're definitely red every time Look, we Yeah, so, so check this out, right? It's working, but it's only vibrating him. Is it supposed to like hurt? It's supposed to shock you. I don't get a zap, I get a vibrate. Okay, so here's what here's what we, you try. Take it out of this, hold both ends, and then just press the center. Well, it's the same thing. Gonna, I just don't wanna do it. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna tickle my fingers though. <laughs> Oh, okay, that worked, that worked. Yeah, Did it a work? Little, little zap, little zap. Okay, so there's another functional problem in this, is that it wasn't making contact with your wrist, so it wasn't actually zapping So let's try you. this again. Can you control this via app too? Yeah, you can control this via app. You wanna like ask me questions, and if I get them right, I don't get zapped, if I do get them right? Yes, I've got the app open right here. Okay. Uh-oh, it keeps connecting and disconnecting. That's not a good sign. Okay, yeah, it has to be pressed really hard, because that one got me. Tight. You have to wear it like really, really tight against your skin. Like a shock and, collar. And probably shave, yeah, like a shock collar. And probably shave your arm. Ready? Mm -hmm. Zap. Yeah. I felt okay, that. you felt that? Yeah. <clears throat> All right. Intensity 100%. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Come here. What is my favorite color? Blue. Wrong. Oh, wait, what is it then? <laughs> green. It's green? I always knew you were a weird man. I <laughs> like green. Who did I eat lunch with yesterday? Elliot. Good. Thank you. Who did I eat lunch with the day before? Amanda. Wait, who did I eat lunch with? He ate lunch with us, right? With me? Who are you looking at? The wall. <laughs> <laughs> the, the mirror. Without looking. Shut your eyes right now. What does the neon sign say? Good vibes only. Is that right? Nope. Oh, what is it? <laughs> it says, let's get weird. <laughs> if you put it to 100%, pretty good. So after some finessing, we can get it to work. Yeah. But in my opinion, it's really just a novelty gag gift. It's not gonna actually be something functional that you can use to retrain your brain to not make bad habits. Quit it. I agree. <laughs> this video right here is 10 unusual products that we found at a mall. And let me tell you, there are some weird ones in this video right here. It's a video that YouTube thinks you specifically will enjoy. Will you? I don't know. Let's find out by clicking that video. And this right here is a big old subscribe button if you're new here. Because if you are, we want to see you here more often. High five.